It is with great pride and with great joy that I introduce to you tomorrow's leaders and the first class of Franklin Police and Fire High School, the Franklin Thunderbirds. This is the grand reopening of Franklin Police and Fire High School. The school is in a historic building that had been long forgotten and neglected in the midst of an emerging city. But just like the phoenix bird that arose from the ashes, so too did Franklin School, being reborn into a center of education for students interested in a specialty school. Franklin Elementary School opened its doors in 1926. The school was on the edge of the town back then. Hundreds of kids walked these hallways over the years, but Phoenix was changing and people were moving further away, leaving Franklin behind. The school fell into disrepair over the years, until ultimately it was fenced off and abandoned. The school lay dormant for over a decade, until hope arrived when the Phoenix Union School District introduced a new family of schools. They were small schools that would serve a neighborhood and educate their students in a specific career path. And this concept of a school, a smaller school but full time, they could start to focus young leaders on not making mistakes, whether it's dropping out of school, whether it's turning to crime, whether it's turning to drugs, but also learning the relevancy. They'll be prepared to enter law enforcement and firefighting career when they graduate high school. A great career, a 21st century career, a career that's needed, that pays well, that this community supports. Officials could not think of a more suitable central location than Franklin School. Ironically enough, the school was named Franklin, like Ben Franklin, who established the first fire department in Philadelphia in 1776. It's the visionary men and the visionary women who have dedicated their lives and their energy to make this school come to be who have already done that work for us. The rebirth of Franklin School was no easy task. The 80-year-old building was in desperate need of a complete renovation. The roof had rotted, the hallways were a disaster, and the building was in such bad shape that it became an environmental concern. During construction, classes were held at nearby Metro Tech High School. They learned about teamwork, commitment, and respect. We really work as a team, and like they tell us, we're a, we're a team, but we work as we're a family, but we work as a team, and uh, we live by that here. In August, the new school officially opened its doors. Fall in. The classes may have moved, but the work ethic stayed the same. It's been fantastic. It's been great. Everything we're learning, the knowledge, the physical training, it's just been wonderful. There's a huge sense of respect for what these folks have done. You look at young people today and they're looking for direction. What a great place to break into public safety in high school. What, what a great opportunity for these people to turn their lives around, to go in a direction where they have a career. If you would like more information on Franklin School or other small schools, please visit phoenix.gov slash no99. Having a job where you can improve people's lives, even if it's temporarily, you know, make us, at some point in the day, you know, you're doing good. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Franklin Police and Fire High School. For No 99 Television, I am Stepan Lovely.